Hi guys, it's Adam from Limit Break Technology here. Out of the box, Gris does not let you use ultra-wide resolutions. So even though I'm running it on an ultra-wide monitor, if I go into the settings and graphics resolution, you can see that it's not running at ultra-wide resolution. So to do this, what we can do is we can patch the binary files to be able to enable ultra-wide. So if we exit the game, and go back to the desktop. I'm doing this on a Steam Deck, but it will work with Windows as well. So the first thing we want to do is we want to go into the Gris folder where Gris is installed, and we want to take a backup of UnityPlayer.dll. So if I copy and paste that, and I'll call it add a dot back onto the extension. So we'll be editing this version, and then we've got a backup if anything goes wrong or we want to revert to the non-ultra-wide. And then we're going to need a hex editor. So if you just want to head into Discover and type in hex, you can also find a, another Windows-based hex editor if you're doing this on Windows. I've got installed GHEX, which you can go ahead and download. So if I launch this, so if we open the unityplayer.dll file in there, so if I click open and copy this location, And I open Unity Player DLL. So on the screen now, you can see the binary string that we need to look for. So if I search for 39, 8E, E3, 3F. And if I click Find Next, we should find the occurrence of that. So we can enable ultra wide for two different resolutions uh, from this example and as you can see they're now displayed on the screen so for myself i want to enable 3440 by 1440 so what i want to do is i want to select this and i want to replace it with the string uh, that is displayed for my resolution now so that's 8e e3 1840 and there's two occurrences of this that I, we need to replace. So I will click Find Next. And here's the other occurrence that I need to replace. So I'll just enter the same string again. 8E, E3, 1840. If we click Find Next, we shouldn't have any other occurrences of that. And we can click this button here, which will save the document. So if I launch Gris again now, as you can see, we're back in the game and the game is still not in ultra wide. But if we head back into the settings and then into graphics and resolution, it will pick up the ultra wide resolution. As you can see, it's displayed 3440 by 1440. If we select that, exit the settings menu, and now we can play the game in ultra wide mode. And this is a game that really lends itself to looking great in ultra wide mode. And if we ever want to go back to the original version without the ultra wide, all we need to do is delete this file and rename the back file to DLL. Now that will be back to the unmodified version and back to the 16 by 9 aspect ratio. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, please post in the comment section and like and subscribe for more content.